Yeah, I saw an opportunity uh, in the industry. I was actually in the banking and processing side of the industry, helping out a lot of hemp and cannabis companies uh, do banking and financial services. And uh, you know, I had a lot of companies that were product-based companies. And I, I saw that they, they really didn't have a whole lot of people in the extraction process uh, or extraction. And the reason for that is that the capital costs were very expansive to do that. Banks were not lending. They were still considered MRBs, which are marijuana-related businesses. And uh, you know, I dived in. I saw an angle uh, in the industry, and that's how Hempstrack was created. I put a team together that had expertise really in the industry, but more importantly, that cared about the product and the plant and cared about the products that we were developing. Uh, the team consists of scientists, financiers, operators, production people, but most important is people who care about the products and, and the customers it serves. When Justin and I first got together to start this, this business, we wanted to find a team that would work with it. And everyone that's involved with this has the same passion as Justin and I. So we saw a problem in the industry. We saw that there were a lot of brands out there, but there weren't a lot of extractors. And so what I did is I kind of married up the idea of extracting and then building brands for people as well as a fully uh, vertically integrated supply chain. Hempstack is in a great space because it produces raw materials and that enables um, companies from small sizes like two women starting out a business all the way to industrial companies um, because we provide quality ingredients in CBD isolate and CBD distillates. The hemp plant comes in dry to us and we're able to create crude, which then can go into distillate or isolate. It's according to what product we're trying to create or build at that time. Uh, we have a binding LOI uh, with, the, uh, with, with Riverdale oil and gas. I've, I've raised all kinds of different plants in different volumes uh, all over the states and I've gotten in a little trouble with it. And then after I, I dealt with that trouble, uh, 13 years to the date, my wife and I got a license to do exactly what I got in trouble for. So now I'm ahead of the mainstream because of the process that we went through way back when and everything that we learned in the beginning when we were having to hide what we were doing and, and get it to people that wanted it without being able to go to the grocery store and buy it. Now it's legal and the hemp side is federally legal. The medicinal side of it is, is wonderful. One of the services that we have from Hempstract is white label service, which makes it very easy for people to start a business because we give them all the support to brand their products, to uh, buy our products and to uh, have the online presence. Um, and so a small business starting out can take our products and run with it to create their business. I think that's very exciting to me.